I'm Alexis. Oh. <laughs> wow. Wait, keep that because she thinks she's Alexis. <laughs> no. Hi, everyone. I'm Ava. And I'm Alexis. And we are the Nicole Twins. Well, today we're going to talk about our, our hair. hair. And thinking about my hair, how long have we had these braids for? Like, I think it's like a little bit over a month. But that got us thinking about like how amazing our hair is. You can do so many different hairstyles with it. You can straighten it, cut really, like really, really curly. Well, sorry. Braid it, corner roll it. So today we're going to take our braids out. We're gonna show you guys how amazing our hair is. Curly hair. It's just like black girl magic. And we want other girls to have confidence in their hair like, like we, we do. <laughs> So obviously we can't, well I can't take all this hair out by myself. So yeah. my mom's going to help. And me. Your sister. Um, no. Is she, no, no. I will, if she does that, I will have a risk of my hair falling out. Wow, that was this dramatic. Is how I Drama, drama queen. I'm not gonna watch okay, you. All right, I'm We're gonna, not gonna be quiet. quiet. Keep that in the video. Be quiet. Yes, please do. So I'm going to help these little knuckleheads take their hair out, yeah, so that I'm not, you're still talking Sorry. as I'm talking, Ava. Like her mouth is. Anything else, Ava? Please continue. So I'm going to help them take their hair out. It's been in for over a month, and let's get these curls. Let's set them loose. Yes. Let them go wild. Okay and free and crazy uh, mm. and just be. Oh, the purple hair go in and the bag. This is what our hair does all the time. Boom, ding, tack, window, everything. You spoke wow. too fast, no one knows what you said. Wow. You guys know what I said because I'm a good speaker. I need to, I want hey, to. But no, you don't start from the middle of your head. This, no, you have to okay. start from the front, otherwise don't. it'll get all mixed up. Yeah, yeah. First and foremost, I'm going to cut this. Can I cut some? So you think I should cut it here, Alexis? Uh, no. if you... No, I mean, it's the front of your head, Ava. Don't even get those... <laughs> Justin, where should I cut it? Here? I don't know, I don't know what you're doing. No! Uh, okay, Ava, she's so dramatic. You really think I'm going to cut your hair there? It's like right here. Right? But you know what the real crazy thing is? I really can't tell where your hair... Oh my goodness, mom. So here's a bit of advice. No, if you cannot tell where the hair ends, you're better off just cutting like the very end, obviously, so you don't cut off hair. But let's see your hair. I, I mean, I know your hair is long right now, but this is the very front. So get, oh, Alexa, put the scissors down. You cannot cut her hair. Why? No, this is the very front, so it can't be that long. So I'm going to cut about here. No. It looks about right. No, it doesn't. Yeah, it's not <laughs> way at all. Ask you how you are. You just have to say that you're fine when you're not really. Ava, fine. it'll go faster if no, three. Ava, no. it will go faster if three people. It's my hair, can, though. Don't worry, Alexis. Like, you can do the back where she can't see you. Okay. My hair, it don't move. My hair, it don't move. My hair, it don't move. It is moving though. <laughs> I know. There's one right in the front. Mama, that's way with. too short. Ava, this is not too short. Where do you think your oh, hair is? This one's look, look, look. Ava, look, this one's shorter than that one. Oh, Mama, you have uneven hair. Ava, none of that is your <laughs> hair. You're so dramatic. My hair's like up to here. Even. Alexis, you're not helping. Sorry. Ava, she's going to help. I'm not going to stand here and do this all by myself. Kidding me? I'm doing it. Listen. Only eight-year-olds are going to fight about taking out hair. I don't even want to do it. And you girls are fighting about doing it. I really don't know where her hair ends. Oh. Mama, don't cut it like you don't know where it ends. Ava, Just face that way. Right don't there. move. Don't move when somebody's holding Just scissors. Cut it. I have an idea. No, it's okay. Her hair's not this long. No. It's not that long. Ah. Uh, no! Ava, would you stop? Seriously, your hair is not that long. And there it goes. Ava, while she's busy crying about nothing, look, she thinks her hair is so long that I can't cut this. Your hair is not that long, especially once it's braided, it's shorter. See, oh look, I can see where it's coming out right here. But I'm gonna cut a little bit down anyway, just to be sure. Just to be sure. A few moments later. What's been your favorite hairstyle? I mean, you guys have had a lot of hairstyles. I mean, they're eight years old with a lot of hair. You've had a lot of hairstyles. What's your favorite? I like the braids the best, and I also like the straight hair because it's good to have a new hairstyle. But I really like over all the hairstyles because it's good to have a new hairstyle once in a while. How could you possibly say you like braids the best when you complain day in and day out when you first get them? Well, okay, okay. 
I like all of them. It just because I like having new hairstyles. So I just don't know. I have a, I've had a lot of hairstyles. And then if I pick one, then I might see another one next time, and I will see like, oh, this is not my favorite hairstyle. So Ava can't choose, and um, I would like you to think about what do you think your favorite hairstyles have um, been. I like curly, straighten, and braids, and pigtails. You say you like all of them. Well, can your dad ask a question? Which hairstyle do you not like? Because it sounds like you said all of them. Oh, I don't like the bald hairstyle. When have you, you ever bald. had that? <laughs> no, you're bald. I don't like no, your bald No, what hairstyle of yours, that. Alexis? Oh, I don't like your back braid, Mama. Mama, our hair wasn't wet at all, and your braid was just, oh my goodness, it was embarrassing. <laughs> My braid. Yes, no, your one braid, remember in the back, I didn't like it. I thought it would be good in the other house, but my hair wasn't like, um, No, Ava, I don't, I don't hold on to those things, so I don't, I can't say I remember. So it sounds like you girls like all the hairstyles Yeah, I have. like all of them. But Dada, um, you should dye your beard. This is not about me, I'm not It's not about hair. your dad's hair. Okay, Mama, out of all our hairstyles, which one do you like the best? Well, as me being the one who's done the most hairstyles on you, I'm going to go ahead and say what I like the best is when I don't have to do your hair. So braids. So it lasts for like a month, right? Yeah, even if it's not braids like this, like sometimes I'll braid just their hair and like, you know, a couple of braids. And I love that because then a good week ago and I don't have to braid, do anything to your hair. So those are my favorite styles now. I used to love experimenting with your hair. Remember I used to do so many different hairstyles on them, Justin? Yeah. Mm -hmm. I'm just going to cut that last See? little curl off. Here, you can, man, if we go back and look, like I used to do like fake mohawks and all types of Without designs. Without fake mohawks? You guys probably don't even remember half the styles they've had. They don't remember, I'm sure. Mama, I, you were talking about when you, you were growing up. Ten years kids ago. Kids didn't like, they didn't like embrace your hair. Not my hair, they didn't embrace their own hair. Back ten years ago, when I was growing up, <laughs> there was just a lot of like, stigma I guess. People thought that not curly hair just wasn't pretty. Everybody had to straighten their hair or everybody wore braids and all these other things. Like nobody ever wanted to wear their hair in its natural way. I guess that was society telling people that, you know, curly hair looked unruly or messy. I'm like, it's just the hair that's growing out of your head. I don't understand. I'm glad that we have this generation like you and you to help little girls coming up now know that this, look at the, look at the pattern that this is very pretty. Actually, I love the way it comes out of braids. It's got this pattern to it, it's amazing. And it's not too like fluffy, right? If I was a kid in the late 1900s. <laughs> I, I think you're talking about 1995. How would my hair be? Okay, well, first of all, you cannot take out hair from the middle. You need to start front and go forward or back and go, That's like, you what can't I just do. be in the middle oh, my of the hair. I'm talking to her, yeah, because then it gets all um, like. Alexis, if you ain't gonna mumble Alexis, like Ava, hush. Hmm? How would your hair be? You'd probably have a perm by now, by eight years old. She'd have a, a re relaxer in her head, so her hair could be bone straight all the time. And you'd have to go every like four to six weeks to get the relaxer put on again, so that when your hair grew out, that would be straightened. Or you would get like a hot comb all the time. You know what a hot comb is? Yeah. Let me show you. I know what a hot comb is. It's a comb that does hotness at the same time. And it brushes too, and it combs too. This is a hot comb. I know. But I don't remember there being electric ones. I remember you had to put this thing on the stove and let it get hot, hot, hot. And then it goes as you were like, that's crazy. But you get that all the time, like all the time. Your hair would never be like this or it would be braided up. Well, Mama, why do you think like people change and our hair is more acceptable? I, don't, I just think that people were just speaking their minds more and saying it doesn't make sense that the hair that I have is growing out of my head that I have to change it to please people. You know, there's no reason. Nobody should have to change what's coming out of their head or anything about them unless they, that's what they want to do. But they shouldn't feel like they have to do it in order to be pretty or in order to please people or in order to get a job, you know. Get a job? Yeah, no, you should. You think you could wear afros and get a job before? Absolutely not. Okay. So black girls tried to, before to look like white girls' hair, like the straight all straight. Well, I wouldn't say they were trying to look like white girls' hair. They were trying to be accepted. Like I said, you couldn't get a job with an afro before. It'd be like, oh, your hair looks, your hair looks like it's not done, even though it's just hair coming out of your head. Um, um my sister just said, 
Ava, you got my hair. This is my hair. No, I'm saying like you're. No, in my this hair. is my hair. I'm and the boss of my hair. Then I'm No, I'm, I'm still. Um, yeah. So, girls, I think what your mom is saying that a long time ago, maybe black girls didn't think it was socially acceptable just to wear their natural hair. No, it's not that they didn't think it was. Well, Why they, would we not think it was? They were told it wasn't. Well, they wanted to get. If, if no, a, they were told it wasn't. They were literally told like you couldn't get a job. You were told your hair looks nappy. You were told right. your hair looks. You were told this. So to get into the school they wanted to or to get the job they wanted to, they wanted to show up with what they thought would be the type of hair that would... No, what they knew, what they were told Wow, Daddy, be. you're learning some stuff, too. He is, isn't he? Girls, I don't need to sit here and pretend like I know the life that your mom has lived or other black people. That's why some of the questions I might have or ask What's my mom? are fine. Alexis, get your hair out of my face. Less talking, more working. Let's get this hair out, girls, okay? No chit-chat. Just work, work. Well, work, 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 work. We can still chit chat. Two hours later. <sighs> Finally done. Hair is out. Look at her, guys. Look at it, Ava. It's got like, I got, what are these called? Hair clips and ponytails all over the place. Because, you know, when you're taking it out, you're just doing a whole lot. Ah! What do you think, Alexis? Ah! Yeah. I like it. <laughs> it is big again. Alexis, your face is like a chipmunk. Ah! <laughs> Ava, do you ever have anything nice to say? It is funny. She oh, has nice. it's pretty, nice. pretty close to the same face as you. It is out. Her hair is free. The This is, I guess you can call this a braid out. Their hair was already washed so that I didn't have to wash it after taking it out because I really wanted to do like a braid out. So I'm going to put some oil on the ends. Don't tell her I did it. <gasps> Y'all are dramatic, Ava. You want to see what I cut off? This. See? Dramatic. Overly dramatic. You want to put it under your pillow? Yeah. For the hair fairy? So guys, I'm going to put a little bit of oil on the ends. I don't even know what she looks like because oh, I haven't I seen the front of her since I started taking out her hair. Oh. <laughs> no, it doesn't. I don't know. Just oil. I'm going to get some oil and just get it on her little ends. Oh. Can I do it too? No. No. They're really nice no. to each other, guys. They really, they're amazing how well these sisters treat each other, like. So I'm gonna leave my hair out, my mom. My hair's gonna get For all now, my yes. face. For now, yes. Hush. No, no, no. After the video, it's gonna get all my face. No, it won't. Have you seen yourself? Here you go. No. Here. <laughs> it's crazy. <laughs> it looks crazy. It does not. This is your hair, Ava. What do you mean it looks crazy? No, no it doesn't look crazy. If I, if I were to put no product in your hair and just have, this is what, this is your hair. Big hair, you should be glad you have so much hair, so much volume. People wish you have as much hair as you have. Cause then they could do anything with it. Like they could cut it to the length they want. Why would somebody wish you have a lot of hair so they can cut it? It feels so good to have like my hair out and I can buckle it and jiggle it around like a maniac. <laughs> That's amazing. Okay, don't whip me, whip me with it. It's like a weapon. <laughs> The message here, you guys, is love your hair, little girls. Love the curliness. Embrace the curls. It's so versatile. There's so much you can do with it. And I have been teaching the girls to appreciate their hair and love their hair for a very long time. So I just want to pass that along to you guys. Pass it along for everybody else. No, you can't. Have my hair. You can do it, sure. And twins, wait, I'm not a twin. And Thank we out. you for watching and make sure you do more videos. Subscribe and show them on the more cases. Thank you for watching.